this is okay. It's great math and science class. What do you got going in there? Is that good? Uh, it's a shoelace buckle. This is O'Keefe, Hello. Fulfax Elementary, 8th uh, grade math and science class. Mm -hmm. So, using the 3D printer here, uh, the MakerBot Replicator 2, and how did you implement in your, or actually let me ask you a question first, have you okay. had any 3D printing experience before? This? None, whatsoever. And then how did you implement this in your math and science class? Well, I brought it in class and the kids instantly were over the moon excited about it, so I decided I had to come up with something for them to earn the privilege of using the 3D printer in a way to connect it to things they're using in class. So they um, were asked to come up with a project proposal. They had to come up with a tool, either an educational tool or a tool with use outside of the classroom, describe the tool, um, describe who it would benefit, and come up with a marketing plan. How would they advertise their tool? Who would they sell it to? And how would they do such a thing? And then they had to give me the written proposal in order to print their tool. All right. It's a keychain, Nike. Yeah. Uh, we have an amplifier for the iPhone 6, 6S, and 6 Plus. Oh, cool. Do you, have, do you play music on it right now? Or? Yeah. Uh, first, this is what it sounds like without the... Is that one dramatic? Sorry, sorry about music. The other one. The other one. Can we take it out again? And then we take it out. There's also, uh, for okay. a charger, you oh, can cool. uh, stick your charger through the hole. And where that hole is, you're supposed to put your charger hole right there. Oh. And there's also room for a, if you want to press your button to go home. No, we need that in our house. This project right here is, is something that I love because the kids' um, first thing that they printed was this, and it's supposed to be a keychain, and you can see it's awfully small. It's smaller than a key itself. So we had to talk about scaling and getting the proportions right for their keychain, and then they changed the scaling of their project, and this is their new keychain design. Fantastic. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.